just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. You are now traveling through another dimension. A dimension not only of sight and sound, but of fuckery so insane that the human mind can hardly comprehend it. Back with another update with Shani. And like I've said, I've taken a break from her, but I want to start getting back. Alright? We're going to do a little bit more updates with her. Man, I don't know if she's getting crazier by the day. Or some people I know, they'll switch personalities like every day. They'll be into something one day and then something the other day. And that's what it seems to be. She's into God and being prophet. And then the next day, she's about the government. It's like... She doesn't know what she wants to do. She really doesn't. And before I catch any COVID from this grubby beast, I am going to put on this. Guys, remember, if you have a mask, please put it on if you're outside. And I'll show you how to put it on. Over your mouth and nose. The only reason why I do this is so you, call, you can hear me, all right? Let's get into her shenanigans, okay, people? Let's go. Okay, and this, wait, one second, I'll tell you. May 13th, 2020, dear police officers. First of all, the police right now are doing amazing because it's an essential job. And I wonder if she's going to commend them or if she's going to start hating on them. Fuck, fraud. Well, she's got 54 likes, so... That tells you, probably. Hi. My name is Shani for Christ, and I'm a victim of police brutality. My name is Shani for Christ, and I'm a victim of police brutality. Don't lie to me, bitch. I'm not cute. Oh, shut up. No, you're not. What do you... We've... There's videos. There's videos, Shani. The cops didn't do anything. The cops were trying to save Rev from getting beat up. officers out there oh do you now oh my god I think they got a word for you Shani and you probably won't like those words just because it's part of procedure does it make it right and moral to do have you ever ever had the integrity enough to think to yourself should I say no to this procedure because this that's them breaking a law why would they become police officers just to break the law? What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? That doesn't make sense. Procedure is illegal and it harms people and it hurts people. It's illegal. What What did you just say? Is illegal and it harms is no what? This procedure because this procedure is illegal and it harms people. How is it illegal? That just doesn't make sense, Shani. They're cops. And it hurts people. Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever thought about questioning how you deal with people on the streets and civilians that may that some people may have mental disorders? And they may be reacting to trauma. And the only thing I'll say is, maybe you're on to something, Shane. Maybe you do have mental problems. <laughs> Not threatening you. Have you ever thought about that, police officers? <laughs> you really need to start acting gently to the people. Gently. We have gone. Is gently? Maybe that is a word. I have no idea. But. Oh my, she's just mad because she got arrested for beating up Rev. Like, oh my goodness. Maybe not beating him up, but she did put his hands on him and like hit him with a sexual whip. <laughs> through way too much and we pay for your asses every single day while why do you think they're out on these streets protecting us right now shanny oh my goodness you you idiot you're honestly an idiot i don't know what's i don't know what's wrong with you you're on the line 
she is she's crossing boundaries like you're going you're crossing boundaries shannies i can't even get my words out right because of you holy this makes me mad you know what the cops are oh, they're risking their life for your stupid ass we the people pay for you why should we pay for you when you're brutalizing us why should we pay and this is a white person talk oh my goodness Oh my, you're privileged compared to some people, Shanny. You got it easy there, Shanny. Calm her down. For you, when you're putting down draconian laws on people Dr and violating our God given rights. Look, <laughs> you ask me. She always has to bring in God involved. Always. Violating our God given rights. <laughs> you ask me, police officers. And you ask this question. Just because it's procedure, it doesn't mean that it's morally right. <laughs> she thinks she's saying something so profound. She has to repeat it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you need to start choosing your moral. You could just hear the conviction in her voice. <laughs> Girls. <laughs> Before you choose your procedures, you were taught to serve and protect the people, and you're not. You're enforcing draconian law. Of, of course, she can say enforcing. Enforcing. Shani, use ING more often. You sound like a redneck hillbilly when you say in, in. Just say ing, enforcing. And shame on you. Jesus Christ, rebuke you. Rebuke you. Like, what the... F oh, my goodness. This woman is crazy. Straight bonkers, people. I think there's one more video I want to show y'all. Robots have flamethrowers First now. Of all, before I start this rant, I just want to say... I want to divorce my husband now because he's done a fucking abomination. Whoa. What is happening? What the frick is happening? What? A divorce? Is she talking about Rev? What? Unto the Lord. I don't get why people fucking do this. He destroyed my food. That's right. My husband destroyed my food. And you know how he destroyed my food? She's trolling. She's trolling. She's got to be trolling. But of course, of course it's about food, right? Fuck. I can make so many jokes right now, but I'm not. Food. Do you know how my husband destroyed my food? This unholy abomination. Is she being... You see that? He put black pepper all through my fucking Stouffer's mac and cheese. Yeah, okay, she's trolling. She got me. I thought she was being serious. Shannon, you got me. You got me. ...that I was so happy for because we haven't had any money for a few days now because the banks have been so slow. So we... Ugh, he ruined it. Oh, my goodness. What a little baby. He was trying to be good. He probably cooked the food for you in the first place. And he maybe wanted to add a little something special for you. And now you're going to act like this? Jeez, he's probably whimpering in the corner right now, afraid to say any words. Like, you would probably scare Rev half to death. I can just see him picturing in the c c corner, sh 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 shaking. <laughs> oh my goodness. I thought this may be the last time I ever have Stouffer's. And he put black pepper in it. Who the fuck puts black pepper in mac and cheese? You are a hater of mac and cheese, sir. You are. Who cares this so much? Like, I, the only time I care this much about Kraft Dinner is when I was a kid. I don't even like Kraft Dinner right now. I like Kraft Dinner, but not like this. Oh, the only Kraft Dinner I love is the ones at like the fancy restaurants like oh my goodness those are so good with the big noodles
for a hater of mac and cheese and you love the black pepper that is so gross i thought she's gonna say you love the black people i'm like racist but no she didn't say that it's like putting mustard in black and cheese. It's 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 no, like it's not. putting freaking sugar in freaking tomato sauce. This is wrong. Woman, I'm pretty sure there is sugar in tomato sauce. You freaking idiot. <laughs> I'm almost positive. There's sugar in everything. This is a tragedy, and it must be stopped. Onto the robots. Dudes, go to my fucking Twitter, man. Dude. Dude. Go to my fucking Twitter, Shanny for Christ. Shit is getting real, man. The robots now, they got fucking flamethrowers. And they're using it. <laughs> Her face. So one of these days, we're, tr we're trying to run from the Illuminati. <laughs> we're gonna see the drones come around with, like, fucking flamethrowers. Like, they're... Motherfucking, I, I don't know. This woman is brainwashed. She literally sounds like me when I was in grade 10. I was a big conspiracist. Listen to Alex Jones. But this is when I was in grade 9 to grade 12. And hey, I'm not saying Alex Jones is totally whack. He said some truthful stuff. But that's just a whole other subject. But she just seems totally wacko. Conspiracist nut. Freaking... <laughs> What is her fucking name from Aliens? Fucking Sigourney Weaver. And, and, holy crap. You're gonna be like, come with us or a simulator, we're gonna burn your ass. And then we're gonna be like, oh my god. And then we get burned to death and stuff. And stuff? Like we get burned to death and stuff? Up and my hair gets singed and then I'm bald. Cause the. Oh my goodness. Think about that. Think about that would be an ugly sight, people. That would just be atrocious. Like, oh my, the bleh, makes me want to puke. Robots burn all my hair off, right? Because I'm going to survive that shit because I got this mark from God. And <laughs> the ugly molehill. No one can kill my ass. Not even a fucking robot. So you're saying to us, Shani, you're immortal. Because of this thing right there. What? What? What the fuck? So, I mean, dudes, I don't know, man. That's like me saying, yo, I have actually a pimple, a big pimple right on my ass, dude. And God gave me that. And it's magical. That's what it is. And if you squirt it, the magical pus is out. Ew, I got really graphic. But still... This girl's not making in any sense. Like, no sense. Robots are gonna get us. Didn't you say you'll survive? The robots are gonna get us with flamethrowers now. They're just gonna burn all our fucking houses down with flamethrowers. Illuminati's like, fuck it, everyone's inside. Take all the robots out with flamethrowers. <gasps> burn us all down. <laughs> nice sound effects there, Shani. The hell? God damn. Like, she's all about God and she goes and uses the Lord's name in vain. What? So contradicting, Shani. You're so contradicting. Anyway, that's me reporting my Twitters. My Twitters? What a boomer. What a freaking boomer. Updating my Twitters. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Alright guys, I thought I'd give you a little bit of my update. I'll be doing more updates, don't worry. I haven't forgot about Shani. I'm still waiting on Tila to go live. Don't worry. And I'm also going to go, me, I'm going to go live. Tomorrow and the next day, we'll see how shit goes. But guys, I love you so much. Thank you for everybody that has subscribed. It actually means the world to me. I'm going to keep on doing updates on Bam Margera, Shani, Tila. I'm going to do my song slash music review slash freestyle, blah, blah, blah. And I'm just going to stick with that. I'm going to be doing a paranormal segment soon. So be prepared for that in the next month to five months. I, I just got to find a place that's haunted. All right.
thought I'd say that here. But guys, I'm a dip. Remember, be safe. And when you guys are out, make sure put your mask up. All right? I'm only doing this so I can talk to y'all. But guys, I'm a dip. Peace out.